Hello guys, let's make a bell, okay? So it's gonna be very simple and easy and yeah, not too much headache. I make the this one the body, let me hide the body and I make this one as well. So let's begin. Control N, oh, Control N, oh, where is it? Uh, Control N, new one. There we go, no need to save. Alright, so here we are with the power of the default cube. So we're gonna avoid distraction by hiding the light. Hiding, uh, I mean, the camera first, or maybe whatever you want. And hiding the light. And let me, let me bring this on, screen cast. Alright. So, at this point, we're not going to use the default cube, so... Yeah, whatever, just delete. Alright, let's make uh, the the big one first, okay? The body, we actually going to use a spear, okay? Don't worry, because it is what we're going to use. <laughs> So we go to gear here, alright, press 3, if you're on keyboard, I mean if you're on PC, using keyboard, I mean, yeah. So we're gonna go delete this one, box select, make sure all of them selected. And delete the face, okay, so we are, there we go, we got that, that nice half of the, uh, over there, I don't know. Okay. So... Make sure an edge select, select all this edge here, there, over there. It's true to the Z, okay? If you want to be more precise, turn this on, the snap tool. Now I'm going to screw that to the Z. How long you want? Depends. It's up to you. Maybe this big, that big would do. Alright, let's add one more. Uh, screw that to Z and scale. Grab that a little bit. Way too long. Uh, nope, it's not too long. Okay. So we got the body there. Let me turn this off. Now we got that one. Let's make the uh, the chain. I don't know what it's called. The one up top over here. Okay. So we can use the torus. That X, 90 degree. Scale it. Scale it down. What did I just grab that over there? Scale. Yeah, that would do. Scale it again a little bit. Okay, let me see. We got enough holes. You know what? I'm gonna bring it a little bit more down. Oh, I'm gonna turn this off. Okay, just just like that would do. And don't forget, okay, duplicate this one. Let me uh, go to here, or you can just go to here. Alright. Shift D to duplicate, rotate Z 90 degree. Grab that over there. Press 3. Alright. You don't need to be this big, so you can just scale it. There we go. It's okay if it don't touch it over there as well. Because we're not going to animate it anyway. We're just going to leave it like this. Alright, that would do. Now let's make the... Uh, what you call the long stuff. I don't know what it's called. So we're just going to use the... A circle. Circle would do. Or you can use a cylinder. Cylinder works fine as well. Alright, scale. Wrap that over there. Scale. Until you get... This one is fit. There, grab that over there. Scale it a little bit. Maybe like that. Right? Extrude that to the Z. Make sure edit mode, okay? Extrude to the Z. If you want to make it bigger a little bit, you can do that. Scale it. Just like that. Alright? Now we get that over there. What if you call that? I don't know. And for the balls, you can use the UV sphere. Again. But this time it's not this, the, not this one, okay? Another sphere. Grab that over there, scale. If you want, I mean, can, you can't see it, right? It's good. It's, it's, that would do. There, scale. Alright. Maybe there, maybe there. Yeah, that would do. Okay, let's bring this back. And there it is. Simple basic shape of the bell. Alright? 
Now let's sh shade smooth this. This one, shade smooth. Okay. And this one. Oh, this one as well, shade smooth. That one, shade smooth. This one, shade smooth. This circle, shade smooth. Here we are. No need to, I mean, if you want, add some solidify on it, okay? Because this is way too thin. But I'm not going to add the solidify. If you want to add, then add it, okay? Now we are done with this. Go to shading. All we need is just to paint. The color that we need is this one. Select anywhere. This one. I'm going to go with yellow. Goldish, I believe. Yeah, maybe that one would do. I think it. I think that's way to green instead of yellow. Okay, that's way to yellow. Roughness decrease to maybe there, but I need just a little bit more. specular. Well, up to you how you want. Then increase it to there. Subsurface I O R. Uh, this is actually oh, I don't know. I don't know. I usually use metal to turn into a metal because it's a metal. Okay, that's way to, I uh, mean to bright, I mean to, to glassy. Up the the metallic. This is a metal. Don't forget, it's a metal. Okay, select them all. Make sure this one is the highlighted the uh, orange like that. Okay, and the others will be the orange with a little bit more red. I don't know. Control L, press Control L, link material, and it should turn all into like all share the same material okay so let's go to the layout now go to ev bring up the light grab that to the y uh, okay i'm gonna increase the light a little bit more oh let's select the light oh the, the power is good all right let me forget bring it to the y okay bring the blue as well Shift D over there. Mm -hmm. Three. Oh, hmm. oh, it was right. That would do. All right, let me uh, decrease the radius. Grab that over there. Oh, bring them down. Decrease the light a little bit. Maybe three hundred. Let's hope it's not way too bright or whatsoever. Just in cycle. It's up to you if you want to cycle or so EV, okay? So let's turn this on, and there it is, guys. Very simple, right? Making a bell like that, and yeah, good place to. I mean, good, good. I mean, good way to start for beginners. Very easy to do, and let me uh, say it again: there are lots of ways of making these. Just have to find out yourself. I mean, whatever, okay? <laughs> there's there's no rules. You can set up your own or you can just follow something else. <laughs> all right, so that's all for today. Thanks for watching. And tomorrow is going to be Christmas. So I wish you all Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. All right now. Bye now.